So go day Kabaro. This is our number one diesel generator and we have a trouble here. The running hours of this generator overhauling is 2800 and it was overhauled by Shurgang last April 2022 dry docking. The water is accumulated inside the cylinder when the engine is stopped. When you air blow, you will notice that it will coming out in indicator cup. There are two factors that water will accumulate inside the cylinder. Either there is a crack in cylinder liner or leaking on the parts of cylinder head. If there is a crack on cylinder liner, most probably there is water mixture in our sump tank oil. On this case, there is no traces of water in our sump tank oil, so we can conclude that the water is coming out from cylinder head. There are three cases that we have to consider if the water is coming from cylinder head. Number one is if a valve slip. If the o-ring of this part is already deteriorated and parts eroded, there is a possibility that cooling water will leak on the cylinder. We already take out this part and replace but still there is water inside the cylinder. You can take out this part by not pulling out the head. Number two is valve seat o-rings. If the o-ring of this part is already damaged, the cooling water will leak inside the cylinder. Number three is cylinder head crack. If the cylinder head has a crack, the cooling water will also leak inside the cylinder. I decided that we will pull out the head for pressure test to investigate where the source of water coming from inside the cylinder. To pressure test the cylinder head, we will use round teflon to plug the holes of cooling water. Make it tapered and hit it by hammer when inserting on the cooling water holes. Put it in cylinder head over holding stand. Use flat bar if the plugs are not even so that it will sit properly when you press on the over holding stand. Pour a bottle of water in the outlet hole of the head. This will serve as a marker to locate the leakages. Tighten the securing nut of overhauling stand to press the teflon plug. Install the pressure tester connection with pressure gauge and valve. Now supply it with pressurized air. Check all the parts of the head that water may leak, especially in if a bulb sleeve and bulb seat. Now we already locate where the leaking is coming from. One of the exhaust bulb seat is leaking. As can you see, there's a droplet of water coming out on this bulb seat. Mark this one so that we will not confuse after we bring down this head for overhauling. As we look at the manual, this head has two o-rings on the exhaust valve only. We will dismantle the head valve rotator, springs and valves for cleaning and overhauling. After we clean, we will pull out the leaking exhaust valve seat. We will use old valve spindle to weld it on the valve seat. Grind the spindle to become smaller so that when you weld, you will not hit the surface of the head. After you weld the spindle, hit it by hammer to pull out the valve seat. And the settings of the valve seat so that the o-rings will smoothly go inside and it will not damage when you install. It's better if you put the new valve seat into the freezer so that it compress and you can smoothly install it on the head. Use grease or Vaseline to lubricate it when you install. When you install a valve seat, put the valve spindle inside and hit it by round sink.
make sure that the valve seat is even on the surface of the head. After we install the new valve seat, we will conduct again a pressure test. Install the teflon plugs and pressure tester. Then open the compressed air and check for any leaking. Clean the parts and assemble. Then install it in cylinder block. After 24 hours, make an observation if there's a water accumulation inside the cylinder. Air blow the engine. There's no more water inside the cylinder and we can service it now. So that's it, Kabaro. I hope that you will learn something on this video. If you like this video, please share and hit the like button. This is Stephen General Elrich. Please like and subscribe my Facebook and YouTube channel. God bless and keep safe, Kabaro.